right, welcome to part two. Just started the medieval era. I'm going to break this down into four parts to make it a little bit more manageable for everybody involved. I got a nice little gift right here, a spy. And I'm going to go steal a great person from the Americans. Ooh, give me code of laws. Oh. Wow, another. Got another barbarian hut. I think that's like my. I can't even. Maybe my eighth barbarian hut? It's been a lot. That's why I have so much money at this point. I still have a camel running around. Camels. My caravan. I don't know what I should do with this little militia guy up here. I'm just gonna get an absurd amount of gold. Waiting one turn gave me an extra 50 gold. See what these little islands over here have to offer. I have 449 gold, which is insane for this stage of the game. Uh, I'm going to expand in every city except for Thebes. I'm enjoying that science bonus a little bit too much, so I doubt I'm gonna... I might... Once I get Code of Laws, I'm actually gonna swap that and grow it to three, though. That would be nice. I guess I'll send this to the Americans. That'll be my consolation prize to them. Barbarians are getting restless. I'm gonna have to move it down there. Wow. Getting really lucky finding all of these different. If I could get navigation out of this, that would be brilliant. So lucky. Just going to continue exploring as much as I can. Get to swap this back before I end my turn. Man, 474. That's crazy.
figure there must be a name tile somewhere. Let's see what this is. Oh, that's just the edge of the edge of the island right there. And it looks like we'll be getting Code of Laws next turn. Beautiful. Additionally, let's break the 500 barrier. Might as well. It'll actually get me a great person. Trading post in roads. So that's good. We're gonna have to switch over to Republic to begin our expansion phase. Let's begin with masonry. We're actually gonna stag. Oh, oh Genghis Khan. We have to grow my city. I like to grow it up to at least three. one more time. I can't believe how many huts I'm finding. Uh, where was that? Right here. Mo money, mo money. rushing some settlers, so I will have to grow this city. Gonna have to play this smart, not lose my spy. <laughs> Running away from the stupid barbarian so that my other guy can take advantage of him. So let's see here. First of all, let's move that over. Take advantage of that trading post. I'd like to put this in a spot where I can take advantage. I'd actually like to go down here. Can make a few nice cities down there. Here would be pretty nice. Got fish right there, no trees though. I generally find that growing to three is worth it, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Let's pump a city out right here. That'd be beautiful. And we'll be dragging on science for at least one turn. 
that's okay. In the long run, it'll pay out. quite a lot by having a science dude right there. Not even sure what I'm going to do with these horses yet. It's a little bit early to know. But obviously I'm making some moves on the Americans here. Worth going to the war with the barbarians over a caravan? It might not be actually. Especially with as much gold as I have. Beautiful. Found some fish over there. Where is that thing? It's right over there. Let's take a look at my cities. Gonna have to... Make sure I'm managing them correctly at this point. Boy, is it hurt not to use that. How much is that giving me? 12? Man, that's like throwing 60 science right in the dumpster. It's just too much. I'm just going to keep that going, because that's insane. generally better to pump your settlers out of the cities that have lower populations because you don't lose as much especially if it's a city with fish like that come on guys get out of my way I'm trying to give you money Here you go, guys. 
Give me iron working or else. Surprises me how many times I can just threaten these people. Let's hang here for a minute. Makes me a little nervous. Oh. Uranium. It's like the most worthless tile you can have. You don't get it until someone has won the game, more or less. This is a good spot, right here. A little bit of everything going on. And can make another one. Ridiculous. I'm actually going to have to run this guy away. That's pretty crazy. Alright. swear there's a name tile there somewhere, but I did not find it. So I'm going to keep moving along. Clear peace when you can. There's really no benefit to being at war. In most cases. You have to take advantage of that marble. Am I going to be the first to get irrigation? That'd be pretty gnarly. Yep. Could be. Thanks for that builder, America. Gonna absolutely have a blast. Doesn't go horrible with it. Uh, let's see, my spy. What can I do with my spy? I don't know. I'm just gonna hang out here, I guess. City of Atlantis. Oh, I need. I can see it's at 24 per turn. If I can get one more, that is too bad. Settlers, I can get out of here. All right, Henry Ford, move it. 
this is a pretty nice spot right here, so I'm going to take it. Got a whale, too. Yep. I don't know why it just warped me away from that. This would be another nice spot. Finally, my horse has made it down here. Oops. Wow. I actually have four barbarians sitting here waiting for me. Excuse me. Let's plant right here. Looks like there's some dye I can make use of. <coughs> mo money, mo money. Coming through. Need to get the Angkor Wat. Well, it looks like our boats are going to meet up over here. So close. I might as well just swap one of these over. Oh, wait, here we go. There we go. something to drink. I wonder if I can make peace with this guy. I'd like to make peace with him, just so I can set up a juicy fortification and right in his own forest. can't believe I just got the plus one population bonus from this. That's absurd. Alright, let's go with literacy. Yeah, literacy is going to give me a nice bonus. Plus one all... plus one science all cities. Alright, finally. Start pumping out some Settlers, man. Here we go. Keeps taking my hammers away. Actually, I'm going to have to play this carefully, because these barbarians could actually kill this horse. So i got to play this smart. That's a nice name, Corinth. Let's keep pumping them out. I'm not out of gold yet, people.
Well, these horses might be taking a bit too long. So here I am with this. Let me think about it. Complete the oracle. Bet you guys are sick of seeing that. Uh, let's go down here. I'm just gonna chill here with the spire for the moment. Explore this central region, that's about it. Um, yeah. Gonna get that in two turns. I need to expand more. Might be done expanding over here. getting a little precarious with a bunch of barbarians. Um, hopefully I don't move the horse here. Damn it. I can't believe I'm using the Oracle against Barbarians. This will be a nice little spot. Let's move down here. No fish, unfortunately, but... Expanding like crazy. Another nice spot.
Great Pyramid. Doesn't give me access to any government I want, but I, I'm just fine with Republic for the moment. Since I am in my expansion phase. Still have a lot of gold to expand, so let's pump it out. It's going to make a big difference. I have a lot of cities, so now I have the plus one science bonus. And what can I get in math? It's a nice little city right here. Especially once I get construction. Ooh, this is Sparta. This could actually be my production city. I have two mountains right next to it. And also, I have this oak tree. In fact, I think that's exactly what I'm going to make this. So I'm going to start growing it. years later, I finally take down this barbarian village. My reward is another horse. That's interesting. It's over here. No fish. There's wine and rubber, which is worthless. I can squeeze in two more cities down here. I should just go towards the coast. I don't really care about rubber trees. Already at 12 technologies, doing very well. Almost getting math in one turn, which is absurd. Got a fortress assembled outside of the American's capital. I'm wondering if I should build a road. Why are roads so expensive? 75, huh? 
I've always thought that those have been ex insanely overpriced. But what can you do? by this fish. Just keep pumping them out. Let's put a sentinel right here to be on the lookout for the Mongols. smoking the competition at this point. Americans are pretending they don't have any money. What do you guys have? Not bad. It's half a settler. That's totally worth it, so... Aztecs are now caught up with the... Americans for second place in technology. That's the end of the medieval era. Just finished up mathematics. And I got myself a free catapult. From here I'm gonna go with navigation, I believe. Yeah. Two whole turns to get that. And I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna it's actually the end of part two, so follow up in the next video to see what happens. Maybe I can get 50 cities before I'm finished here.